Hello guys, in this video we'll be using the data in our array to create a table. So I'm making this into a second video because the first video was a lot longer than I expected. So to display this data on the table, we just need to go back to our code and we'll start from here. So instead of null here, we want to put our table code here. So whenever we have values in our array, in our CSV array, then we want to have this table shown. So I'm going to use the table tag and then uh, the table head and then some th elements. So this will be uh, three of them. Name, age, and rank. And then we need a table body. This table body will be populated using our CSV array. So CSV array dot map um, item. You know, do this item. So, see uh, table row first. Table row. So, we'll carry key element which we want here. So item and I here. And then um, table data. Inside of it, we'll have the. Um, Item dot name age rank h rank. So let's see this. So let's see. Okay, so here you have it. It's a very straightforward arrangement. You just map your content from the CSV array. So if I refresh the page. We don't have anything being displayed because the array is empty. There's no list there. So let's upload our sample. And you can see the state for the file has been updated. Then we submit. You can see our details shown from here on the web page. So that's all you need to do to display CSV data. On your web page. See, we didn't install any packages. So it's done with plain JavaScript and the file reader and the file reader class. And the file reader object, sorry. <coughs> so thanks for watching. See you in my other videos.